intersection of two lines. Line L pass through points A 1 2 minus 1 and B 11 minus 2 minus 7 while line B passes through the points C and D where C is 2 minus 1 minus 3 and D is 9 minus 10 3. Show that L and M are skew lines. Skew lines are the lines which are not parallel but still they don't intersect since they are in parallel planes. Correct? So for skew lines scalar triple product should be should not be equal to zero. Correct? If scalar triple product is not equal to zero then they are skew lines. So let's see what is line L. So line L is going through point A and B and therefore we can write line L as so we'll write in the matrix form we can use one of the points as the point so we'll use 1 2 and minus 1 the point A plus parameter lambda times this minus this which is we can take 11 minus 1 just to make it 10 positive right minus 2 minus 2 will be minus 4 minus 7 minus of minus 1 will give us minus 6 so that is our line L and what is line M line M will be we can take 2 minus 1 and minus 3 as a point and another parameter is a mu right and then we will do 9 minus 2 which is 7 minus 10 minus of minus 1 which is minus 9 and 3 minus of minus 3 will give us 6 right so these are our two, two lines and for skew lines we will do scalar triple product so the scalar triple product means so 1 is this coordinate x2 minus x1 so we can do 2 minus 1 so 2 minus 1 is 1 minus 1 minus 2 will be minus 3 minus 3 minus of minus 1 will give us minus 2 and then we have 10 minus 1 minus 4 and minus 6 right 10 minus 4 minus 6 and 7 minus 9 and 6 7 minus 9 and 6 right and if we calculate this what do we get we get 1 time minus 4 times 6 which is minus 24 minus of 9 times 6 which is 54 minus minus of minus 3 will become plus 3 times 10 times 6 is 60 minus 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 becomes plus 7 times 6 is 42 and then we got minus 2 times 10 times minus 9 will be minus 90 minus of 44 times 7 28 which becomes plus 28 correct so that's what you get and if we calculate this out so 1 times this is minus 78 and 3 times 3 times okay plus 60 plus 42 is 102 we'll do it later and minus of 2 times minus 90 plus 28 will give us minus and 12 means 2 and 8 means 62 correct so that's what we get and we, if we calculate this out we can write here minus 78 3 times this is plus 306 minus minus becomes plus and we get 2 times 2 is 4 and uh, 4, 12 8 times 6 12 2 times this is 2 times 2 4 and 2 times 6 12 124 so we say that it is not equal to 0 right so if we do that we get 10 minus well 
we can use calculator in any case so it is let's do it here so minus 78 plus 10 and 1 3 and 1 4 and that is equals to 12 take away 8 is 2 and then 10 take away 8 is 2 and then 12 take away 7 is 5 352 so we're left with 352 which is definitely not equal to 0 therefore the lines are skew correct so that's how we can show that the lines are skew lines